drunk with the ecstasy of love, I can no longer tell the difference between drunkard and drink, between lover and beloved. Mm. So the difference between, that like God isn't separate, that you're, you're experiencing God That's as it. God. Yeah. Or divine. Yes, and, and that is uh, the mystic's gift to humanity. It's a way of understanding what is the nature of our mind, of our, of our soul, right, mm-hmm. of our consciousness. Mm-hmm. That awareness itself is the divine expressing itself in the world mm. through human form. To be one with the divine. Yes. That's the ultimate goal. But it's so hard because we have an ego that separates everything. Yeah, yeah. And the idea that we can, let's say we can devote time and, and energy and focus to, to dance, to music, to art, to love, even romantic love, and even drinking wine together and sharing kind of that 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 feeling that it that warm feeling that it mm. gives us right of being connected to the vines and the, the grapes, the grapes and, yeah. uh that that's that, why the, that, the uh, church drinks the wine they have the wine ritual yeah. yeah that all those activities can be a form of devotion you notice they give you the wine right before right before they ask for the donation <laughs> so you're like okay no, i'm just kidding <laughs> yes but anyway that yeah I, I love this idea of um the devotion to the divine and uh and those you know a lot of the people we work with are entrepreneurs and they're coaches and they're trying to like build a business and they have dreams and passions that mm-hmm. they want to share and it's we have to be drunk with that passion we have to be one that the divine in us wishes to express itself through us that that um that kind of falling in love that kind of like drunk with love with our passions and and to live fully and it, it feels reckless in a way to, from the ego's perspective is to you know take the guardrails off and and go and fail and and uh, explore the ups and downs of you know starting something creating something uh, but that's the beauty of life and uh, and to be one with the divine as you do that it uh, it's like almost like your duty you have to 